The decision that we're going to talk about today is from the First District Court of Appeal in the Bay Area. Um, a group of neighbors to People's Park in Berkeley, California, filed a CEQA environmental challenge to a plan to build $231 million worth of student housing and low-income housing on the side of People's Park. The first district court of appeal ruled in favor of the not in my backyard neighbors um, and found that among other things, the idea of students having <clears throat> loud and noisy parties was an environmental concern that justified uh, re remanding it back to the superior court for further review, delaying the construction of housing. Uh, as a double Berkeley grad and with uh, three children who uh, attended UC Berkeley, I'm very familiar with People's Park. Uh, it has quite a bit of notoriety. Back in the 60s, there were plans to turn it into an athletic field um, and uh, a number of <clears throat> locals uh, started a protest. Uh, and on uh, May 15th, 1969, uh, massive riots broke out at uh, People's Park, and uh, one individual was killed, many were injured, and ultimately 2,700 uh, National Guardsmen were brought into Berkeley to patrol the street for multiple uh, weeks. Um, so it's been something of a, um, of a rallying point. Um, but this decision by the first district is not only nonsensical, it's horrible. Uh, People's Park today is a huge homeless encampment, full of waste and extremely dangerous with multiple felonies committed. Uh, and it is extremely unsafe to even walk past. Um, and somehow the idea uh, that Theodore Roosevelt um, and John Muir in terms of their environmental vision uh, wanted People's Park uh, as something to be preserved environmentally is absolutely absurd. Um, and not only that, in terms of just the big picture, uh, it's not just housing insecurity in Berkeley, where the housing situation for students is absolutely the worst. It's food insecurity. 44% of undergraduates uh, um, around the UC system experience some food insecurity every month, which is defined uh, as lack of food in quality and quantity due to insufficient financial resources. Uh, by not having enough housing and putting uh, financial pressure on students, um, uh, it creates situations where people, after they've paid their tuition and, and, and paid their expenses, don't have uh, money for uh, for food. Um, five percent of undergraduates um, in the UC system uh, have housing insecurity. Uh, so, uh, in terms of this idea that the idea of rowdy, loud college parties uh, being an environmental threat compared to the hellhole that People's Park is today is uh, a shameful decision. Uh, the uh, governor has uh, decried the decision. Uh, the regents have vowed to appeal it to the California Supreme Co Court. Um, and let's hope uh, that some rational uh, thinking is applied to this problem. John Belcher, Law Offices of John Belcher.